my name is Aaron Tan. I'm one of the undergraduate program leaders here at the University of Greenwich, and I'm also one of the faculty learning technologists. My name is Gerd Christandl. I'm a senior lecturer at the Faculty of Business and a learning technologist at the very same faculty. learning technologies that the university uses ranges from being a repository. So for example, if students aren't physically on campus, they can access all the resources online. Um, we also incorporate learning technologies in terms of um, the way we record and deliver the lectures as well. So if students do miss a lecture for whatever reason, it's recorded so they can revisit it back. We've used software platforms where students have given avatars to engage in virtual conversations. So there's this a platform called High Fidelity where we had to deliver sessions online due to the pandemic but still needed some sort of group discussions. So they were given an avatar and they could walk around a virtual space and as they get closer to avatars of their classmates, they could hear the, the volumes louder so they can, it's almost like they're engaging in real conversations. We're exploring a range of different technologies to really enhance the student experience and their curriculum. So at the Greenwich Business School, we're actually working on the learning technologies that support our students. To immerse them in the learning without them realizing is actually learning. Uh, we are also trying to bring in virtual tours for the students to immerse even more in the experience, authentic learning, authentic assessment. And at the end of the day, hopefully virtual reality, which would immerse them even more and learn at the same time. So the University of Greenwich is really committed to being the best modern university going forward. And one of the ways they're doing this is through investing in learning technologies for our students. So once they graduate, they're not just book ready, if you will, or have the theoretical knowledge, but they become employment ready as well, because they have a combination of the theory and concepts, but also have the practical skills by using the technologies which we've embedded in their curriculum. So a 3D printer is basically a printer which prints models in three dimensions and it's taken from an art file, a 3D art file, and essentially prints in layers, very thin layers, and lays them one on top of the other so that over time it creates a whole model, a physical model, which you can physically touch, see, lift and inspect. started to explore a virtual reality VR, augmented reality AR and mixed reality XR. This is in the very beginning at the moment. It has the potential to be highly immersive. It's an environment for learning. It is wonderful because it is so immersive. One of them will be simulations, uh, specifically more immersive style simulations using a mixture of augmented and virtual reality to see where students can actually engage with the surroundings to implement the theories and concepts that they're taught. So basically at the end of the day, Grange Business School wants to improve the students, wants to bring them forward, forward to the future. And for that, we will use learning technologies. We will, will be developing learning technologies for that purpose in order to get the students where no students have gone before.